This is Zach Newman from the Fiercely Independent Network. We're at Bearsville for After Antarctica. So you guys are all in touch. What are all the other guys doing from the six? The yeah, the other, they're, everybody's still around, unfortunately, but thanks to the internet, we always stay in touch. We had a 30th reunion in Japan right before COVID broke up, uh, came about. So, yeah, everybody's doing their, their, their various things. Uh, they're still in science, and John Wayne's got a big project in the Southern Oceans, and, and uh, so we're pretty much the same. We're really totally, totally involved in our passions of cold, cold weather places and preserving them. Sure. Um, I'm Tasha Van Zant, the director and producer of After Antarctica. I'm Sebastian Zeck, one of the producers and the director of photography of After Antarctica. And we'll stick the subject. Cool. Along uh, with Antarctica. Yeah. <laughs> Along with Antarctica. <laughs> uh, yeah, so just tell us about your film. Um, so After Antarctica follows Will Steger's journey as an eyewitness to the greatest changes in the polar regions of our planet. So in 1989 to 1990, Will led the longest crossing, dog sled crossing of Antarctica in history. It was 4,000 miles, seven months across the coldest continent. Um, and now 30 years later, that route has largely changed. So it's really a look at Will's personal eyewitness to these changes over the years. Uh, cool. Um, do you guys have any more screenings here at uh, Woodstock? Um, we today was our only screening, but we do have a uh, a panel tomorrow um, called Eyewitness Storytelling, and that's going to be at the White Feather Farm at ten thirty. Yeah, we were very familiar. Uh, the, how we recruited him was different. John Lee was a diplomat just during the Cold War, so we made contact within the Soviet Union where we got Victor, and then uh, China was on not on a very friendly side with the United States at that time, and I recruited the other two guys. Uh, over years, and then we have trained actually for two years together. We crossed Greenland, the longest route, which is a very historical, unsupported expedition in itself. And uh, we visited each other in the country, so we were, knew each other very well when we went down there. Without that proper training, especially uh, being together, living together for two winters before, uh, we, we all agreed that it wouldn't have been possible, especially our Greenland tra training, because we would have just perished if we didn't know really what we were doing there. Um, the mantra for Woodstock Film Festival is fiercely independent. What does fiercely independent mean to you guys? That's a good question. What do you think? Um, I mean, I I think of Will when I think of fiercely independent. Uh, I mean, he's paved his own path, as you see in the film, and he's really, um, you know, uh, he's crafted his own legacy and, and really done everything his own way. and. Um, hasn't taken any compromises and you know the way that he organized the Trans-Antarctica expedition was all on his own terms with his team and the t that to me is fiercely independent. Cool. Um, what are you guys looking forward to in this year's festival? Oh well we're just so thrilled to be here at the festival and are excited to check out so many films and also really looking forward to the panel tomorrow. Um, and it was so special to be able to screen the film today with a live audience and hear all of the audience reactions. And just to be here in Woodstock is really special. Awesome. Uh, and final question, uh, how did you uh, guys become involved with this film? So um, both Sebastian and myself are both from Minnesota originally, which is where Will is from. And uh, we grew up really admiring Will's work and uh, legacy and impact he's had in expeditions, the environment, and also as an incredible documentarian himself. Um, and so we were able to meet Will after he gave a talk in Minnesota uh, years ago. And after that, started this journey together. Awesome. That's it. Uh, all I got for you guys. Thank you, cool. guys, Thank you. you guys are amazing. Thank, Thank you, so you so much. much. Appreciate it. Thanks, Nicholas. You're welcome. Uh, for more from the Fiercely Independent Network and to learn more from the Woodstock Film Festival, please visit www.woodstockfilmfestival.com.